As president of Missouri Valley College, I want to let you know that we have planned a wonderful commencement weekend for you and your families on October 10th, 2020. Let us all pray that this terrible pandemic has left us by then, or at least lessened enough that we can get together and celebrate in a proper traditional manner. For now though, I want to congratulate you on your accomplishment as a graduating senior and to wish you the best of luck in the future. On behalf of the Missouri Valley College Board of Trustees, faculty, staff, and students, congratulations on a job well done. Congratulations, graduates. Today, you become official members of the Missouri Valley College Alumni Association. As a member, you'll be a part of a special Viking community that celebrates all things Viking always. Our hope is that regards your next chapter in life, you'll remain connected to your alma mater. Through these tough times of a global pandemic, you and your classmates have strived through extraordinary circumstances, and for that, you should be very proud of yourself. On behalf of the Missouri Valley College Alumni Advisory Board, we wish you good luck, Godspeed, and Valley Rural. If you know me at all, you know I'm pretty good with numbers. Today, I'm sticking with what I know best to talk about the senior class of 2020. Numbers, 476, the number of students who were named to the fall 2019 Dean's List. 15, the number of men's and women's spring sports teams whose seasons were affected by COVID-19. 46, the number of states represented on campus in the 2019-2020 school year. 55, the number of countries represented on campus in the 2019-2020 school year. These numbers may represent stats specific to the class of 2020. However, those numbers alone could never fully encompass the actual experience of spending your last year of college as a Viking. For example, 437 might be the well-known house number where I met the people closest to me today, but it will never explain the late night decision of having a bonfire in the backyard on our last night together. Six might be the injury-defined number of cross-country races I was actually able to compete in in the last four years. However, it could never take the place of the laughter shared during 7 a.m. team ice baths after a 5 a.m. practice. Two might be the number of conferences I traveled with Dr. Libby to, but it could never replace the memory of walking in downtown New Orleans in business casual clothes in the pouring rain. One might be the number of times the nonprofit program was named National Campus of the Year, but it will never compare to the countless hours spent serving the Marshall community alongside my favorite classmates and professors. 1,417 might be the number of students that attended Valley this past year, but that number could never tell the story of every second chance given through receiving a Valley acceptance letter, of each dream being fulfilled by the answering of a call from a Valley coach, of the family histories that are being changed by the first generation college students receiving their degrees today, or of all the friendships and relationships that have stood the test of Missouri Valley and will go on to last a lifetime. 234 might be the number of students who are ending their time at Valley today, but it is also the number of students who are beginning their new lives away from Valley. While we all may have our own numbers that define our own experiences here, Thanks to everyone at Valley, we're all more than just numbers. Congratulations to the senior class of 2020. Once a Viking, always a Viking.
President Humphrey, it is with great pleasure that I present the candidates for degrees for the 2019-2020 academic year. They have been approved by the faculty and the Board of Trustees and appear today for the conferring of their degrees. President Humphrey, distinguished guests, colleagues at the faculty, family and friends, with great pride, I present the class of 2020.
By virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees of Missouri Valley College and the State of Missouri, I hereby confer upon you the degree of Master of Arts, Bachelor of Arts, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Bachelor of Science, Bachelor of Science in Nursing, or Associate of Science, or Associate of Arts, with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining thereto. Congratulations. Dear Lord, this is the day that you have made. And we've been caught off guard in ways we could never imagine. Rather than celebrating together, our graduates are tuning in from their homes in every hemisphere. Remind us, please, this is not a virtual graduation. This is the real thing done in a new way. Our masks and social distancing do not cancel our personalities. And we've learned in a most dramatic way that being apart from one another is a challenge, not a barrier. Isn't that the lesson we should all know? Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Today we can't hug or high five or shake hands or share a meal in a crowded restaurant. But we do know that our graduates are prepared to do great things in good ways. And we pray that you will guide them as they combine imagination, technology, compassion, and patience to secure lasting relationships. Fortify our kids with loving determination. They are pioneers living into a new normal. They will be our teachers. Bless them on their way. Amen. <laughs>